I want to talk a little bit about, uh, from the inside view of a practitioner, how weird the financial advice market is. Um, as was alluded to, it's just a really strange one. Um, number one, you've got this break between um, people who generally think they don't need advice, and they go out and they do their own thing. Let's call them DIY, um, do-it-yourself um, investors. And what you generally see is that they would benefit from help. Uh, the people who least think they would benefit from help. Um, would most benefit from help. They overtrade, they don't do sensible things in a tax perspective. Um, they make lots of little mistakes that end up hurting them, obviously not the least of which is not saving enough. They focus on the investments rather than the savings component of it early on. Uh, they have limited attention. They don't actually pay a lot of attention to their portfolio all the time. There's lots of things you can do. If you can tweak things each day, look out for tax loss harvesting opportunities, various things, um, that would improve their outcome. They might be given tools, but those tools generally like still involve them pulling the trigger and monitoring things. Um, and as we document all of these sort of mistakes that individual investors make, it starts sounding like the case for an inv a advisor gets stronger and stronger. <laughs>